We can call to order at 520 on November 1st. President So French, Lee Whitcomb, George Marcier, Lori. Yep. Lucia. I'm here. All right. Meetings. Everybody read meetings? Minutes? Minutes yes. to the last meeting. All right. Got a motion? I have a motion. I'll move that we approve the minutes for October 18th. Mm -hmm. I second that. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. Ma'am. What do we got, ma'am? House verification. Bills. Two bills. And the verification form from the buyer of the house on guard both yard. Oh, the Dowd House. Mm -hmm. Um that we don't need you, to... well Will and Brock's. No. Will and Brock. <laughs> no. Millie's house? That's not former house. Former Millie's house. That's me. Yeah. Yeah. The children still miss Millie by the way. She was fantastic, wasn't she? Yeah. Like you know, my forty-year-old children, <laughs> they'll remember her fondly. Mm -hmm. So we have a bill from Mohawk office and service contract site for on the books for evaluation. Total of fifteen ninety-five fifteen. Mohawk, that's our annual. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Marshall and Swift. For the books. Yes, 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 yes. The annual subscription. I move to pay these two. Total of fifteen ninety five fifteen. Total between and yes. planned on. Yes. Yes. And I'll second the budget, I think. Yes, they're in the budget. A no motion. Lee motion, George seconded. Oh, all in favor? Aye. Aye. There we go. Okay, so we'll just initial the bill. Or we can, we can, in, because you've got a couple of copies of things. Well, that, one goes back to, yeah. one stays with the, the accountant's records and one goes back to the vendor. Right. Well, so we'll just finish one of each and then rest consign the bunch. Yeah, she isn't that interesting. That person said looking she was looking for two and a half years and it was a dream house when she found it. Yeah, and paid fifty thousand more than yeah. I was asked. Well, that happens with houses like that. They just go to into a bidding war. Mm-hmm. I want it, therefore I have to. Oh, my auntie. Yeah. I may have done the same for that house. It's a lovely house and a yes. lovely piece of property. Yeah. I would have done it for use case also. Mm hmm I'm assuming the people who sold the piece of wasn't the Will and Brocks, but someone else. That's right. The people who bought it from the Will and Brocks, their name was Bowd. I signed up in the corner of two of them. You'll find them in there. Oh. Oh, yes, just the house and the little shed, not the lot where the animals were. They kept that. They kept it. Some just kept, kept it. Yes. Hmm. Yep. I think it's because. They weren't able to sell it as a whole. Mm. Get the price they wanted. Um, yeah, there's. I mean that that lot has was it was a house lot. It had the big trailer on it for years, so <laughs> it could be again. But it's it's so leggy that it'll be a difficult perhaps to build on. I don't know. 
They may eventually. They so, might. Yeah. yeah. One of your butters might buy it. Did you? Did you see the postcard that the realtor mailed? No. She mailed out. She mailed out the postcard to all the residents with a picture of her in the house. Just sold. Twelve seventy Lately Road. <laughs> I was like, yeah. Uh -huh. Like I did it. <laughs> right. Okay. Sales. Mm -hmm. Looks like we have that one that was a prime link. Yeah. And we have and that one's transferred within the family. I think most of them, mm -hmm. all the other ones are. So it looks like all the rest of them are just mm -hmm. family. Yep, convenience. Yep. And we had. We sold for four fifteen, asked for forty nine, and we had it assessed for three thirty. Twenty five percent off. Marketplace knows all, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. You want to Have you ever experienced a period just... when when it was the other way? Yes, just, there was yeah. in the nineties. Sometimes people okay. struggled and had to sell, and so we were having to. Two thousand and eight, we were having to lower values because they were coming in. They were selling at prices lower than we had, oh. and so we had to lower across the board uh, for a couple of years there to stick with the market. Well, well this one sold for less than the list price. Yes. Yeah. So someone got, I guess, a little ambitious. Well, I think the list price might have included that second lot. Oh, I don't know. Now this one. Oops, sorry. That one to here. This is our people who have the two lots over on Williamsburg Road, and they wanted to be at sixty-one B. We told them they had, they had to take them out of it because they were in different ownerships. They now put it in the same ownership. So do we want to <laughs> review their application in light of this or put it off for a year? Any discussion? Did you catch that? No, I'm sorry. I'm okay, that's all right. You remember, we had the two properties over on Williamsburg Road that were in 61B, and we realized that they were not, they, they were in different the ownerships name. in the same family. One was the two of them, one ownership was one alone. The one you inquired about, yes. the planning board. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So we took them out, 61B, and she said, What can I do? And I said, The only thing you can do is make May have a deed done so that both of the PR parcels are in identical ownership. Right. Then we can value them together for 61B purposes. So they've done that. Okay. It was recorded um, a week ago. Yeah, a week ago exactly. So do we want to? So the ownership is the same now for both yes. contiguous lines. Yes, right. it is. But of course, it was due to first the black and Well. No, not due till December 1st for 2025. Oh, no, that's right. But that's for 2025. It was right. due before the taxes were begun. Now she's going to call me. Hmm. Sorry, what's the issue? So the question is, is do we want to do we want to look at their 2024 Hello? application again? Okay. What and reconsider it in light of the fact that they're now identical ownership. <laughs> What's the deadline for 2024? Lee? Yes? What's the map 111? What? There's a parcel on that list that has a map 111. What does that mean? I don't know. I'll have to look at it. If she doesn't know, she'll have to look at it. We have a 411. It's, it's over 530,000. This is Jan? Yes, this is Jan. Okay. Hold on just a second. Yeah. Sorry, excuse me. Yeah. Keep going to look at that. 
Because this one wasn't was not an arm sale, not an arm, no. because these people are all related. And it's what parents giving, yeah, bringing the kids in. Yeah, these well. these are different, all different names, yeah, all different yeah, names. Yeah. But only was it well, 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 was it a dollar yeah. for each one? Yeah. Total of a dollar. It was it was not an arm length. Uh, this I'm maybe I'm looking at the wrong one. This is four hundred and some thousand. It's no, the, this one this one goes with. Goes with this. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. Yeah, the one you're talking about is this one. I'm trying to get the Loomis. So, right. one of them used to Marco or Abraham. Or like, the guess is like a son. And this one also is resuming the life of date. Sorry, guys. I don't see them. But when I was, even though. Can't say. What's the announcement? Um, I mean, I'm not, it what really happened? didn't get recorded early enough to change it on the tax bills for this year. Right. But I had. Okay. Is no one listing up there? Karen, pause the recording while she's on this phone call until we continue the meeting. Oh, okay. There we go. I'll get back to her after our meeting. Okay. So back on this one. Uh, the other one you oh. were talking about, Paula. Yep. No, yep. And yep. you were asking them to. Do you think that we should uh, reconsider her ap their application for twenty twenty four? My question is. That's allowed. The deadlines are such that. Well, the deadline. Well, the problem is we you approved the 2024 application last year. We did, yes, last year. It was 2025 where we noticed the but problem, and I told, told her that 2024 was going to have to be rescinded. Right. So now you need to decide whether or not to reverse the right. rescind. So they have fulfilled the conditions. Did you? Well, when did they fulfill the conditions and, and they, they are fulfilled them in October? It last week was recorded. <clears throat> okay. So did they do it in time, theoretically, to apply for? If they did it in time for the corrected values. If the tax had had, taxes had been mailed when the taxes were supposed to be mailed uh -huh. on October 1st, it would not have been in time. That's right. Because they would have already been processed and gone. But because bills have not gone out, there's an artificial <laughs> window of... I know. It still doesn't change the fact that you have to file by October 1st. December 1st. December 1st. That's right. It's, it's but December but for 2024. That's for 25. Right. If, like, all the people that were filing for last minute for for 2024 had to do it by October, October, by 1st. October 1st. Actually, we wanted it sooner than that, so you'd be able to get it in properly. So, yeah. It doesn't change that fact that it wasn't done prior to the deadline. So they filed an application, but they didn't did I they hadn't changed the... This was the, the one where, we caught, where I caught the acreage. Yes. Okay. And, and I wrote to them end of August? Probably yes. And the lots, the lot status changed when? For twenty five. A well, week ago, October. A week ago today. Yeah, last week, October twenty five. So they missed the October one deadline. Yes, absolutely. Well, sounds like they missed the deadline. Mm -hmm. So she will probably file for an abatement. Mm -hmm. Which she's she entitled. Can file. Yeah, which she's entitled to do now. Mm -hmm. And the abatement would be for 11 months or essentially. Well, it would be to change it to the other value. 
I would expect. I don't know what her, I would think that was what yeah. she would put as her reason. But it would apply for about 11 months worth of. Mm, it would apply for the, it, it would hmm, apply to the whole year. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because the change was mid month and. Well, no, it's a, it's a change in use code. Yeah, but it's kind of a complicated one because of the fact that the prorating it, yeah. It was approved for the previous ten years. We approved it for ten years. Ten years. It's not B, it's something else. No. no. B. no. We approved in, in, the two pieces that were in two different names, not realizing it. That right. <clears throat> so what ten years? Mm, was it that long actually? I mean, Annually that's, for ten years. That's what you had said. You, you. Yeah, I, I looked it up for the letter. Yeah. But legally, can we approve it for twenty-four if we wanted to? Because this change. I'll, I'll check with I'll check with Lauren, our local advisor. I'll write to her about it. And get her answer. I mean, she's going to say because we're allowed to do these things because it's a revaluation re year. Revaluation year. We can apply changes. At the, you know, mm -hmm. at the discretion of the, the dates, board. the dates change in a, in a revaluation year, and nowadays every year is a revaluation year. When we have to do it across the board, mm -hmm. that is. How do the dates change in a revalue year? Um, someone can apply for that year up to October first, not having had to apply the year before for. It. If, if it's 1st. not a revaluation year, then you can't apply for that year at all. Right. Right. You have to. But you're still dealing with October first. Yes. Yeah. I'll I'll write to Lauren and get her direction on it. Yeah. It's just a it's just a different one because it already was in chapter and. And it was rescinded because mm -hmm. she discovered the lot problem. Mm -hmm. right. Yeah. Which she fixed fixed up as quickly as she could, considering she had to get yeah, lawyers to draft the deeds. Get lawyers and go through the yeah. The, I mean, well, registry of deeds. And without so. making a motion, it seems to me that that out of consideration, it'd be nice to grant it. But legally, Cameron is my question. Yes. I mean, I go along with granting it also if that's legal. Right? Me too. Okay, I'll check with Lauren. But is it too late? But the tax is it too bills. late? That's the question. And we'll let her tell us that. Well, okay. I meant for the tax bills. Oh, no, we can do it through an abatement. That can be done. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> What's a deed of distribution? Uh, that is for an estate to settle an estate. The that individual left everything to the person who actually is the executor of the estate, mm. and so this is, I think, to close out the estate. And it's a deed from him as personal representative to him as the heir. It's the named heir. That's Michael Olafson. Mm -hmm. Is Margaret no longer with us? No. Sadly so. She passed away before Buster. Yeah. No. Okay. Look at him. Yep. Look at him natural. Mm, solar. <laughs> Lots of soul. Mm. I wonder if there are any special incentives going right now. You see the thing on the Google or whatever all the time that Massachusetts will pay for your solar if you live in these zip codes. 
Well, both the state and federal government have various kinds of programs. Mm -hmm. yeah. Good. We'll get maybe a little bit on this one. I don't know. It won't be new for all, so it might be. 20 by 40, one story house. Yeah, that was the small house that Sue was building for herself move into as her retirement home and she would leave the house up on the knob, you know, for whoever mm -hmm. took over the management. Yeah. Well, it's a hybrid, not water heater. But I don't know, that's a new one. Uh, solar and? No, it doesn't say anything about solar. It just no. says, it says wire or hybrid. All right, the electric. Huh. I don't know. You'd think it'd be a combination, something new like solar or heat pump. Captain, Maybe it's with an oil wood burn. wood fire. <laughs> I don't yeah. know. There are certainly you know, wood slash oil burners. Oh yes, yeah. It's an OFF. The wood burning boilers they call them OFFs. Other fuel? No. What is that? I, I don't don't ask. I me call it out OFF. Well, no, OFFs. all of it's what it is in the the Board of Health regulations refers to them as OFFs. Mm. Other fuel furnace, maybe. Mm, maybe, yeah. A lot of maintenance. Yeah. Mm. More solar. Yes. Yeah, a real run on that. The solar? Yeah. Well, Eversource went hiked their rates so high. Oh, after the, it was after the first of year after the first of the year for 2023, their rates were hiked tremendously. Oh, so people that contacted companies about solar then are just getting their installs. Mm -hmm. Right, that takes a long time. It does. It you just have to wait till they have time to get to you. Right. We'll make a point. Yes, we're going to have to get to the. Parker House. There's a lot of work is being done there. A lot of work done done. Mm -hmm. Up at the Alice's school. Mm -hmm. Yes. Justice? Up to the school. No, well, um, the old Alice Fire. Oh, okay. Zajac. Yes. Mm hmm. He took a lot down before he rebuilt it up back mm -hmm. up again. I think this hybrid is solar because they're talking about outdoor disconnect. Oh. That when makes you sense. get solar panels, there's an outdoor an outside disconnect panel yes, for fire emergencies. You can you isolate the panels from the electric mm -hmm. system. I think there's actually an inside and an outside. So is this one that says deinstall and reinstall roof mount and solar? Is this one that was 25 years old? Uh huh. We'll have to look at it. You missed this one. Oh, I must have. I did see it. Just didn't initial it. Yeah. Can we see this already? Is have we seen a anything about re-roofing here at this house? Did they have to take the solar off in order to? I sometimes yeah. I didn't see any. They will not do the panels unless it's a relatively new roof. Yes, but so. if they were reinstalling solar, it could have been damaged. Yes, from a storm, could have been old, and mm -hmm. the degradation was just to the point yeah. where it wasn't worth it anymore. Mm. Well, so it was. Property a minute ago, what was 
Orbit Road, Mm Capilano. What was was the other one? Um, It could have been electrical or plumbing. Yes. There's multiple permits for one house. Mm -hmm. There'll be a building, an electrical permit, or plumbing. Okay. Wow. De install, reinstall. I shoot to me. Hmm. That's a pain. <laughs> Somebody might have done something wrong and they had to pull them all in. Oh, could have been with the, be. the connecting me. That could be. Yep. My golly, a big number of. It um, was. It was a big couple of weeks. A lot of permits got processed. Yes. Well, like fall, everyone's trying to wrap things up. I guess. Things down. Planning the winter work. I don't know. To get ready for the holidays. Used to be you would see a lot of things happening. <clears throat> People would put a kitchen in now, you know, to have it ready for the holidays. <laughs> you haven't seen much of that in recent years, though. Huge amount of it, very much growth. There's no quite. Yeah. Several generators and not much. People playing, yes. Yes. Um, the pickleball players it, uh, have moved you, indoors. Yeah, every night. Yep. It's every just, every day they're here. Yeah, they start three three thirty. Yep. And yeah. very ardent group, you know, I mean, they play devotedly every day, yeah. Yes, they do. Yeah. And of course, that's one part of why they're looking for... Yeah, but that's not going to change it in the winter. No, it's they'll just, still be here in the winter, yeah. So we winter. may hear some shuffling and so forth upstairs. It isn't as bad as it used to be when it was basketball. Yeah. Oh, golly. Because like they're racing back and forth. Racing back and forth and going for the the, the jumps, you know, and... Whoop. <laughs> Sometimes we look up and expect to see tiles falling. Once in a while, we get a group up there that is very loud because they do a lot of yelling and screaming and hooting and hollering, yeah. and, and it, it it's very loud. Yeah, but relatively, it's like this. And I, you know, like I told Jan, I raised four kids. I've learned to tune out. <laughs> yes, most background noise. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh. Hmm. Upgrade to an amp to new to an Yes. Yeah, I saw that. that was, <laughs> maybe it was just a service. Or... I don't know. Maybe it was just a service while they were building and now they're actually putting in a panel or something. Oh, that's that's easy. Easy. Yeah. Out, mm. so it can be out. Yes. Well, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Where's North Hill Drive? That's off Cricket Hill, old, uh, no, regular Cricket Hill Road. Down off Whiteley Road, you go up there. Oh, going it's to, one of those two yes, and... yes, it's the one to the right. I was going to say, there's nothing off of old Cricket Hill Road. No. <laughs> well, yeah, no, yes, there is. The line is right. Yeah. 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 No, That's true. Yes. There's nothing off old, old Cricket Hill Road. There is no old, old Cricket Hill Road. Oh, there was for a while. <laughs> You can only access that now by horseback bike. Yes. There's nothing bigger than a pony caboose going down that. I'm sure. Okay. Looks like one automobile abatement. Just look at that.
Get it created in our nest. Oh, I believe. Oh. Yeah, because the registration was canceled. Yep. All right. Okay, move to grant. motion on that. Yep, move to grant the single motor vehicle exercise abatement we have. Uh, second your motion. All in favor. Aye. I don't know. <laughs> it's less than 30. Is it the end of it? it well, much? there's a hat, there's about a dozen that we still don't have. Okay. Some that I'm a little surprised that we don't have. Hmm. You mean they haven't filed them yet? Right. Well, I got the least some before. Right. right yeah, up. that's getting close. I do have the list <laughs> made up. Um, um, try and call in the middle of the month. Yeah. There are three um, DCR yeah. forestry there two belong to one one owner two belong to one owner and then a third okay yeah a lot of them expire this year the two that belong to one owner we've already processed their application mm -hmm. the one that i was holding on to the one for the other person waiting for their application but we haven't gotten it yet so i figured we should at least do this and I already sent them a reminder email because I have a copy to have it. Oh, wonderful. So. Well, you want to look them over and vote on them all at once, or what do you want to do? What do you think? Please look them over because I'm not qualified to determine whether they... Okay. Let's look them over. I, I, I don't review, mm -hmm. like I said, I don't review them. I right. look for a signature, and that boxes are there, and that's it. Okay. Another pain in the hands, but forestry plans often include very good maps mm. of the property. The the foresters, you know, they'll do the streams and everything. And so they can be very informative that there is an old foundation there. Yeah. Yep. So you'll have to sign the front of this. I gotta sign it. Right. Okay. I'll initial the uh, initial letter. Okay. You got any fun? Yeah, I'm just I'm looking at it. Oh. And it's cool. I got well, there's a piece of it by the reservoir. Right. And then there's the home piece. This is piece by the reservoir, 34 acres. There must be the home piece. Then. Yes. 57, 859. Out of 172. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Sounds like it's about the same. This is not our standard form because the top sh sheet is the return letter letter to um, the forestry department saying that yes, we've accepted it. When Russ signs it, it informs them. So
We need to have one piece of land. Yes. Yeah. One on South Park, one on Lauren Brooker. Okay. I know where this piece is, and I guess it's a separate piece from the transfer station. Yes, this one is out behind it and south. Should I take these together? pull very much out if the house is on it. No, these aren't the house pieces. These aren't. No, they each own those individually. And this is the rest of it they own together. Okay. Yeah. Look we'll at them now. You want to sign them and then hold on them after we sign them? <laughs> or, or... Well, no, just let's just run them around and then we'll sign them. That um, way we all have a chance to look at it first. I signed these. That's different. That's, yes, that's different. yes, that that's we just initial. These will get our full signatures. These need to be copied to be and in mails. Yep, because I got to send me copies to VCR and to um, um, Did all these people do their uh, second pages? You know. Uh, like this one, there's no acknowledgments page. That's the one that just came in today. What oh, I, what did I? No, she didn't. This okay, one just came in today too. Okay, yeah, it slid right by me. It's a good reason to look at them first. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're just passing these around for the moment. Oh, we're going to pass them around a second time. Not upside down. Well, yeah. All right. Um, Rocky Road, Rocky River Realty is Western Mass Electric. Really? It's their branch that owns real estate. Yes, wing. yes, that owns land that's not necessarily under the tension lines, oh. high tension lines. So they put those pieces into um, Chapter sixty one B, and that's what this is. Yes, the name. Yeah. Huh? Here's the rest of it. We have a four street plan on the east of here. They just check them. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes, we have one here. Yeah. They renewed theirs a couple of years ago. 
and he had to change the names and so forth. Good. Yeah, is that going to change something? I'll check their plan, but it probably they didn't need to do anything this year. It might have been a rest, you know, a year when they had yeah, nothing. Even got to check. True. Is this? I mean, did they need to pull something out for the house too? Or is this like this is both pieces? This is across the road. The uh, number twelve is the house. The house parcel. The, no, it's where the barn is, opposite the house. Yeah. And then this one is the one they bought from the courses. Okay. Bob's old cornfield. Yeah. But they don't have the acres, all of that woodland on it. I think I'd best check about that one. Right, drop another one. Yeah. So you can apply for both. 61 well the forest that's 60 mm -hmm. 61 e plane yeah and then 61 b as well yes yeah depending on the different uses of your property but for the same total yes 37 mm -hmm. yeah so it would seem like almost anyone who's under forestry program could claim 61 b as well right no, you, you you have one or the other. I mean, in that particular case, how many acres is it? Thirty-seven. Thirty-seven. You're saying they're splitting the thirty-seven. Between. Oh no, they aren't. They're all in forestry. That's just a mistake in filling out. And that's it's enthusiasm in filling out the form. Yeah, I'll double check on the forest management. So, but I'm quite sure that's enthusiasm for the. Uh, Rest of the recreation. Yes, the, the ecology and recreation. So in the case, completely in, a, in a case like this, you would put them in the higher classification of the forest? I would put them in the forest, yes, because that's what we have the plan for. Yeah. And it's been in forest for many, many, many years. That doesn't matter if they fill the form out this way? No. No, as I say, excess enthusiasm. <laughs> we have one farm, well, several farms where they get split up. You know, they have 60 well, acres. Yeah, they'll have that. 40 and 20 or sure. something like yeah. that. Mm. Field over here and a forest yep. over there. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, like yeah, we yeah. were talking about yours. Right. Like this that one I have a question on Okay. Checked off this forest. No, I think that's an error. Because she's all in, in A. And we do not have any management plan there. Is that a uh, legit application? It's a legit application. I mean, the, everything is needed for 61A. Um, it just has this extra checkoff mark, but we have no forest management plan for her. She doesn't have any forest to speak of. So you think this is an erroneous I think that's a, an yes. erroneous yes. form? So, so I think that one entry is. So yes. that we cross out their red <laughs> or because these forms don't go beyond us, it doesn't matter a hell of a lot. There's that, but we do want it to be clear for next for next year, for future years. So you take black ink and cross that out? You make yeah, I think I'll write so checked in error. If you do that, you might want to do it on this one as well. You think I should do that? I would do it if, you know, mm -hmm. well, I mean, in, proving a in, form unless is, we, the only other choice we have is to send back the form right. and then make them redo mm -hmm. it. That. Yeah, I just feel a lot of proving something that's. Error on the form? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking of how many forms Lee's either corrected or completed in entirety over the past 20 years. And oh, yeah, I know. I don't think. You know, making a correction because I send them a copy and they'll see that the correction was made. Yeah. I mean, if it's not something that was like a really bad thing. Right. Yeah, I would just footnote it so that yep. posterity could say, oh, right. 
I wrote checked in error, no forest management plan or forest land. I'm assuming they're not really seeking 61B, right? Right. Don't forget you've got all the ones you pulled out two weeks ago that you wanted to follow up on the sheets with. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There, let's see what I wrote there. Oh, Robertson, of course. That's a Robertson. Bob Robertson. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> This is the case where uh, lease E is applying. Uh, he fills it out. And because he's the one actually, you know, using the land and running the land, so he does fill it. He fills it out. But the taxes are going to the owner. The owner, right? So we have both referenced there. Oh. I'll type out on check. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I think they would have figured it out. Oh, I'm sure it's already in the system as a vendor. So. Oh, okay. Do what I just clicked on the vendor and I'll bet what I want. Good. So this is all that one has a four string. Yes, they do. All right. Yeah. Let me see. So this property uh, off, Main, off Main Street is yes. probably the remnants of what used to be called the Reed Farm. Yes. Yeah. I have just enough to be in chapter. Yeah. It looks like it's being hayed by a bird mm -hmm, target. Yeah. Oh, good. 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 And might not be a pain in the butt. Huh? However, this person checked forest, but apparently meant to check recreation only. Yes. No, that's forest. forest. They yeah. happen to have people who use the land too, but it's forest. Well, good. Yes, I should put a footnote there. Okay. Yep. Same as I did on Schuler's section of necessary. Here, I had a plan done. You put your laptop on that simply to make it a more comfortable height. You know, to keep me off camera. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's it's blocking. It. See, it blocks the camera. Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> Can I get one of those? <laughs> no, you name it. I'm not a member of the board. I don't need to. Yeah, I know. Well, if it's Halloween, I could wear a mask. And if I could learn to keep my mouth shut. I wore my Halloween socks anyway today. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Gary, I don't know who I think it is. Let me scratch this off. Let me check this. Does he have one of these? I don't think so. But he has filled out the other side. He, he does. I don't think he does that. Anymore. I don't think so. The cord would. Yes. Apparently, so he's checked this. He scratches oh, off. Oh my if goodness! You look on the other side, yes, because I think we we put him in B because he no longer qualified for A. All right, I'm quite sure he's enrolled in B. Oops. Mm. He is forest, so you start out in forest, but you gave up on your forest plan. Um, uh, that one was a sixty-one A. And just went with the more easily documented B. No, this was 61A. Agriculture. Agriculture. Yeah. But this form he filled out, he scratched off the end. As, as time went on. He'll check this off and then filled out. Yeah, I mean, that would happen if, if you started out haying your field, say, and then yes. decided not and, to. Yeah, then become d disabled in this particular case. Um, so what is it? It's he's in B. He's in B. Okay. Yes, yes, they do. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This one has nothing checked. No 43, no, no 61A, no 61B. Well, drop another one. I drop another one. Yep. The numbers out on that, I don't know. Oh. I mean, I know, I, I know he's 61 A, but yeah, I don't know. He's got a pretty big total down here. Is this total? Yeah, uh, 74. That's <clears throat> 111, 75. This comes up to more. Okay, scratch that one off. Scratch that one. Yeah, I have to get it worked out. Because this doesn't add, add up right. the same as that. Okay. I'll get out last year's and. Is, he's got a forest plan, but nothing yes. else for the house, or is that a separate piece? Uh, that's a separate piece. Okay. Yeah. The plan clearly spells out all the different all the different pieces.
Okay, this one is six and a half hay. The rest is woods. Yeah, but he's not, he doesn't have a forest. No, he so doesn't. Even so he would be 61 hay. Yes. That's what I was supposed say. to have a forestry for that too, but so if we take 47.4 and subtract 6.5, we're going to be at what 40.9 woods. Does it matter that this one doesn't say how many acres on this form, but refers us to the plan on file? That that's fine. Uh -huh. Oops, that's what I'm reading. This yep. one we know this is forestry because we just signed. Yes. It, so yes, <laughs> it's there. Okay, so we're down to twenty-one. We're down to twenty-one. Yes. So, Okay, as soon as George looks at that one. Oh, mm -hmm. Yes, we did. I have no idea how many. <laughs> oh, Russ County. We had 25. Had to pull out four for further action. Um, what am I looking at here? This is, six, this is 61. 61A. For agriculture. Yes. And there is a hay field. And, and cord wood. a bunch of woods around it, right? And they checked off the recreational stuff. Yes. Um, this is your. Ex? No, that's theirs. No, that's theirs. So this is moot. That I believe that is yes, unless we ended up putting the piece of the house on it. And remember, they had that camping thing going. <laughs> you think this might represent two different parcels? Yes. Total acres 58, acres classified 47. Okay, 40412. Parcel 40412 has 58 acres altogether. Yeah. So of which, does that say 58 on there anywhere? It says total acres 58. Yep. Should be classified 47.4. Okay. Four. okay, well, that's all out of that piece then. So there is no. Well, let me B. check here. Yeah, okay. So he included the house lot in that because that is in 61B. So the house lot is 4414. Okay, pull that one out. Now we're going to follow him up. Had to pull cheese to get that one back anyway. <laughs> we're down to 20 now. <laughs> now, I've seen this one on South Park Road before, but that was not as paperwork. Forest, the forestry management yes. plan. So that's okay, basically okay. Mm -hmm. I would say. Yep. Very loyally. Probably need some action All right. Okay. Do so I have a motion for 20? I move to grant 20 chapter application. I was going to say, we can, you know, George start the move. All right. All right. George can <laughs> start. <laughs> Well, oh, let's see. Your signatures somewhere or just initials? No, uh, just initials. No. Oh, no, 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 that's right. No, no. That is yeah. back to you, okay? No. No. Down here. Right. No. No, no we do, we just initial them. Here. There. Yeah, okay, there it is. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. No, I thought some of them were on the front page. No, uh, just motor vehicle, whatever. I think. Yeah. It's November one. It is. Yeah.
How long weeks worth we got of this? Just one more meeting? What? Probably. Well, some will come trickling in first of December. Except but. there's not that many left. That's so right. probably two more meetings. Two more meetings. They might yeah. have, what, a half a dozen or ten each? And then it's just going to depend a lot on on whether Lee is firm on her deadline or wishy-washy about it like it's she usually December is. December 1st? Yeah. Huh. You usually I'm accept. No, no more wishy-washy. They told me they can't do wishy-washy, so. Who told you? Lauren. Did she? Yeah. Because I know you you always still yeah. let them trickle yeah. in I afterwards. Yeah. Like for months afterwards. Well, we if, someone had, if someone had someone had an extraordinary situation. Well, of course. You know, that's <laughs> yeah. Well, no, that I mean yeah. illness, injury. Right. Death. Alien abduction. That one. <laughs> extraordinary. Yeah, something happened like that, we'd certainly want it, Grant. I guess I'd have to write if I... Lauren first. Kind of a ball do they use in pickleball? Like a tennis ball, or I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Pick upstairs after a bit. Yeah, watch. It sounds hard, you know, when we hear it bouncing around. Japan.
Discussion program conversion. Mm -hmm. And I have here the um the order form. It is, isn't it? It is, but which is essentially a contract. Yeah. And um it's exactly as we expected, uh, the conversion. Four years of data will be ten thousand five hundred dollars, and then there will be the hosting fee of twenty seven forty, and the annual fee of twenty five hundred for support. So it comes up to a total of um, fifteen thousand seven forty. Now, because the contract itself for the program is over ten thousand, I called Veronique and said, uh, "Are we allowed to sign this, or should the select board?" And she said, we would really appreciate it if you could come to our meeting the next Monday and bring it along and, you know, just discuss it and mm -hmm. give the board a chance to ask, and ask questions and so forth. And probably we'll all end up initialing it. You know, that kind of thing. No, so this in, this I mean, considering the they the tablet also. No. Well, my Not question yet. is, is they, they already did it, already passed town meeting. Yes. Why are we asking for their approval again? Because there are some restrictions on what a board can sign money wise. Even though it's been approved, I thought it wiser to ask than to. Mm -hmm. So they've asked us to come to the selectors meeting November 6th? Yes. Yep. That's... It starts at 6. I asked her what time we should be there. She didn't say yet. I will not. Okay. Okay. That's what I asked. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, I think I can send them a copy of this ahead of time. And they can go over and have any questions of it ready, you know, and I can't imagine this much. And um, I will contact Jeff. I haven't had a chance to, to tell you the truth about the tablet. Now, the, but the deadline for getting things on the warrant is coming up. Yes, later this week. Or next week. It was extended a little. I just don't remember when it is. Right. So I've got to get right on that tomorrow. I'll do that. Um, do we have the price of the tablet? Yes. We do. I thought you had Oh no, not the that. tablet itself. Right. Okay, tomorrow I'll be making some calls. So that's what we have here. Um I guess I just figure that There's no, nothing really to vote on. No, that's right. It's simply a matter of signing it. Yeah. Right. And if we have to wait. And I, I don't, I think that we have to be able to sign it ourselves, but. Um, well, I can be there Monday, so there'll be two of us. That's good. <laughs> so mm -hmm. Whether the selectmen are needed or not, the two of us will be there. And we can sure. Yep. All right. Two out of three is enough. Mm hmm. I don't yeah. even, I, I believe there's only one signature requirement on the contract. Oh, well, there are three lines. Is there three but, lines? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, there are three lines. Well, if I'm there and you're there, we'll have more than enough people. No, actually one. Between the select the Name, title, one. date. Yeah. So it, it's, yeah, it would either be Lee as the administrative assessor or Ross as the chair. Okay. Or Phil as the chair of the select board. Mm-hmm. Shall we vote to, do we need to vote to authorize me to sign it on behalf of the board? I don't think so, but okay. I think you should vote whether or not to approve it pending the select board's okay, so you don't have to wait until the next meeting to sign it and send it Good out. Good point. So yeah. moved. I'll second that. All in favor. Aye. 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 So you've been authorized to sign that for us. Yes. And the subscription starts on December 1st and will end next year on November 30th. It starts when? December 1. Oh, okay. Yep. Um, during my downtimes when I was waiting for phone calls back and so forth, and <laughs> so I made a conversion checklist up to check on each account. And I've started doing that in, in free time. Um, one thing that that does not include is our work on effective ages. I'm checking details to make sure all the details are in place, you know, and the 
little boxes or X that need X's or whatever. Um, but we really need to look at some properties, property cards, and decide on the effective age chart that we're going to use no. and get it into place before the... If Patriot calculates effective age automatically, then... We can change their chart. That's the thing. We can change the they chart that they the use. Chart, right? they, they do, but they and each town can adjust it by themselves. They sent me one from Fairhaven as an example. Um, I would look at a, a chart from somebody local that uses yeah, it, like I'm Ashfield going. or Shelburne. Hmm. Or... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> no, they happened to send me that one because he has said, oh, well, I was just working with Fairhaven. I have that one here. I can send it right out. I would try to be consistent with our neighboring mm -hmm. towns. Yeah. Same weather, same. Mm -hmm. What would be different Builders. from town to town? What factors would be different from town to town that change the effect of age? Within um, our little region, I don't think there are many. Between here and Fairhaven. There could be, yes, there are going to be a lot. Or, or with the boilerplate version that's built into the software. Right. We need to see that and uh, have a good look at that compared to the others. So I'll have them send me a copy of the one that's built in. He hasn't already. Okay. And that's that all I have on conversion. Okay. Are we still okay. going to use the conversion as an opportunity to use a training period? Or? We need to write the ad. Sorry, I don't want to. No, you're right. I don't want to bring that up. I just don't want to. You're right. I don't want to see you trying to teach somebody because. At the same time, I'm doing the conversion. Yes, and all yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, yes, it's time to write the ad. Put that on your note. Mm. Okay. All right. Yeah. Other business beyond that. Tax bills. Yes, I was going to. What's Janice working on them now? Yes, she had used a process back on our old system, the state system. She had used it with Mike Quinn Livin, who was the consultant from the state, where she could go into a CSV file through a text viewer program and make changes to it or corrections in our case and still close it and it would be properly formatted to be sent to the billing company. So she's willing to do that. Um, we've identified many of the, most of the problems and solved most of them. Uh, so the process right now is at the point of running one more extract after today's work with Tyler and comparing the, the values between the extract and the calculation and see if, because we think it's still going to be short in value, the extract is going to be short in value. So we need to find out why and where still, but there have been so many steps to solving other problems to get there. Ouch. Uh -huh. <laughs> Somebody felt that. So we're working very hard on it. Um, I would not dare say when they'll be out because. <laughs> well, is there, isn't there some state regulation here? There is a DR deadline date. Yeah. What was it? December 31st. Yeah, December 31st. Well, my thoughts are next week. So that's the state of that. If you want to help with some of the conversion and checking okay. things. Just call me and let me know. Yep. That'll be terrific. Getting you know, check things checked over beforehand and spotting anomalies and whatever. Um, technical question that town clerk might be able to answer. If you needed help just checking data, <laughs> and I came in to do that. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Is it just a member of the Board of Assessors helping the administrative assessor and therefore not a meeting? It would not be a meeting. It would be more or less a work, a work session. session. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which we post, but yeah. 
not required technically. Um, it's not a posted meeting, 48 hour notice, et cetera. You know, it's, it's not even the kind of work session where you're discussing right. site visits and values. We it's might pull just, out a couple of sheets and say, okay, we're going to need to discuss them. Yeah. I'm, I'm, but, no, I don't think that would be any different than the tax collector and the treasurer working together on a project or. Well, the difference is that we're both sitting on the board. And mm -hmm. The question is, there's two right. members of the board of assessors doing assessor mm -hmm. work. It does make be, a quorum. It should be a meeting. It does it, make a quorum, so it should be posted as a work session. Yeah. So, so if you could schedule mm -hmm. times, if possible. Do our best. I mean, theoretically, I was talking to someone in the Attorney General's office. One might make a distinction between an assessor meeting with the administrative mm -hmm. employee as opposed to a member of the board. Right. 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 I mean, that is true. Mm -hmm. If that you were true. replaced by somebody else at some right. point in the future. But over there working on that computer, I'm right. the administrative assessor. Right. right. Exactly. So he would be working with you as the administrative assessor, not right. as a board member. So that makes a huge difference. That's right. I don't believe that would have to be posted. No, it right. would not. No. 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 No, no, I would not. Volunteer. And thank you for bringing that up. That is, yes, yeah. yeah. If it, you were it, when I was sitting over there checking numbers, that mm -hmm. would be. It's a lovely board. technicality. Yes. <laughs> yep, an important one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sure I thought of that soon. Mm -hmm. Other business. We have no. Problem. We have any other business. Well, we'll need to get started with site visits. Get going with them. Let's get the taxes out first. But after, yeah, everything, yeah. everything is after the, the bills. Out taxes out, ad place, conversion started. Any public comment? We have no public. They they watch after the fact. They what? They watch after the fact. Oh, we did. We do have one person who asked for the explanation on the uh, abatements last year. And I have been working on it again when I'm waiting for calls back and this kind of thing. And I did call them and explain to them. And she was fine with it. The fact that it's taking longer than anticipated. Okay. Oh, okay. Perfect. <laughs> Something we know. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, it was an abatement we were revisiting. Thanks. And I had told her we were explaining in about a month. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, next meeting, November 15th. Motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. All in favor? All right. All right. All right.